All right, all right, all right, guys. How are we doing today? Let's jump right into this thing. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Everything's working fine. I hope my, I hope my microphone isn't being a little shoddy. I know it has been doing that recently. So I'm just sitting here kind of like praying, praying it picks up on my voice. Uh, all right, so today, I mean, today we're just going to start doing some classic format stuff. I mean, why not? I, I love the classic format. I think it's awesome. Um, everyone loves classic format. We're all waiting for the classic format, right? Uh, and I'll, I've been hearing a lot of people just, you know, they want to play the Mythic Heroes. Halvar obviously won the first uh, gold tournament, which was awesome. We played that deck last week. I figure right now, you know, while we're still waiting, while I'm still doing my side projects, we'll just theorycraft some more classic decks. Classic decks. Um, just to reiterate, I will say this. Uh, my website that I'm working on is coming along fantastically. Uh, I obviously don't have, like, all of the decks that came out in, like, tournaments and stuff like that in the past. So, I'm not sure when PlayFusion is going to put out those uh, gold event deck lists or if they have them or if there's a way to contact them and ask for them. I don't know. But I would love to get a hand on every single one of them so I can put them on my website. Um, I'm going to try and make it as visually pleasing as possible for you guys to go ahead and navigate it as well. Oh my god, I went from zero viewers to seven all of a sudden. This is amazing. Hey guys, how are we doing today? Yeah! Um, but yeah, I'll just repeat that. Uh, my website has come along really, really nice. Uh, right now I pretty much have all the, all the base layouts now. I just got to start putting in the deck lists. Right now, I only have the ones that uh, Tetra has shown on his uh, stream, which is awesome. I like copied all those down, did word for word, know what that. So I'm getting those put on my website real quick so that people can start looking for the deck lists. Obviously, I am going to try and more focus right now on like the classic format because hopefully at the end of the season, classic will be what everyone's looking for anyway. So I want to jump ahead on that. I don't want to put in like the old deck lists. If anyone wants to find those, they're on uh, Heroic Starfish and Delivery Crab Doc, uh, and the Lightseekers website as well. So right now, I'm just kind of trying to gather as many classic format decks as I can. Uh, Fresh Gen, hey man, what's up? How are you doing? Um, and uh, in doing so, I have created a new email for that website as well. It's just razorgreshu uh, at gmail.com. So if uh, any of you guys have built a classic deck that you just think is fun, Think is fun. Think is good. Whatever you want to do. If you wanna, if you want me to post it on my website, just email it to razorgreshu.com. I'll type it right here in the chat. Go ahead, email that website with your deck list. Uh, if you even want to, like, give a small description of like what made you go to this deck, uh, what works about it, stuff like this. Just a little, like, so if someone looks at the deck and goes, "Hmm, okay," but they're not sure what exactly it is. Just give a brief description of what the deck does, how it works, how you've come about it, whatever you want to do, and I'll add that to my website. I will more than happily I'll give you the uh, content creator. Obviously, give me like your gamer tag too, so I can give you credit for it as well. Um, but I am going to try and get that up. Oh god, depending on work, I want to say like this week weekend or next weekend. Um, I still, like I said, really want to get a hold of Play Fusion to see if they can send me the lists from the first gold tier tournament and try and get all these classic lists up as possible uh and what i'm also going to do i'm going to i'm going to kind of take a side note out of a tetra stream the the moment i get my website up and running i uh i already talked to my girlfriend she fully supports me on this and says she'll start giving me food off screen i'm going to do my own 12 hour stream to promote my, my website uh and i am just going to spend the entire 12 hours just theory crafting classic decks putting them on my website as we go along as we make them so that you guys uh like you know, I'll have it updated or whatnot. Obviously, probably won't update right away. I'll try and get, like, formats so I can do them really quick. So I can just pop them on there, save it, good to go, all that stuff. So you guys can uh, check out the deck list on my brand new website. Uh, I hope, as I'm saying this, you're all like, yeah, it's super awesome. That sounds amazing. It is going to be, like, a strong community-based website. It's not all me doing this. If you guys, like I said, want your deck list up there, please email them that, uh, to that email address. Send your uh, gamer tag name, the list. If you have a sideboard for it too, if it's a tournament legal one, put the sideboard in there, description, and I will, I will do my best to get it on that website as soon as possible to share it with everyone else out there. Um, that being said, I haven't had a whole lot of time to work on the emotes. Sorry, I've been trying to put the website first. Uh, the emotes will probably come next month. I'm crossing my fingers. I still have time for all this stuff. Um, what else? What else? What else? What else? What else? Uh, tournament next week on the discuss the, the f ability to discuss the, the future. Oh, I, st I haven't changed 
Uh, I haven't changed my ability, have I? Oh, that's amazing. Hysterical for me. Uh, yeah, just go ahead and activate that ability, man. Activate that ability. And we will talk about it. Where is my... Oh, God, I feel so silly now. Come here. Come here, ability text. S-Darbs. You totally caught me on that one. You totally caught me. But, uh, yeah. I mean, this is... This is what the future of... Should all be good now. I think I got it. I think I got it. Awesome. But, uh, yeah. This is, this is just the future of my stream, my channel that I want to go to. As I said before, please follow me on YouTube. That thing is going to start shooting up real soon as soon as I get some personal videos on there as well. Because, at the end of this month, I am going to be putting my Twitch channel... On a kind of, if you want to, sorry I cut you mid-flow, always notice that. Dude, don't worry about it, man. I will ramble, like, for hours, so it's either you get a word in right now, or you're just going to be waiting the entire four hours I'm streaming today, and you're not going to say a thing. Feel free to mention any random thing you notice. I would love to fix it, otherwise, I'm like, man, I'm, I'm going to look like an idiot here. Uh, as I was saying, you did it again, I love it, I love it, s, -S Uh Please follow me on my YouTube channel, that stuff is going to go, uh... It's going to start blowing up here as soon as my website goes up. I'll start doing personal videos, tutorial videos on maybe some of these decks that I've been playing a lot frequently. Just kind of like highlight videos and stuff like that. Because on my Twitch streams at the end of this month, I'm going to put it to where if you want to watch the Twitch videos. And I know this is kind of like a toss-up because I'm seeing a lot of my videos or viewers coming from my Twitch stream. Uh, but I'm going to be putting it as if you want to watch the streams like right away after it's done, you have to be a subscriber. Uh, otherwise... Give it like 24 hours, and I'll put the entire Twitch stream up in chunks on my YouTube channel. Same content. You're not missing out on anything. You're just watching on a different platform as YouTube as opposed to Twitch. Um, it's just I'm, I'm doing that so that uh, for right now, it is beneficial to be a subscriber, I guess. And so that my, my YouTube channel can get more viewers, get that growing, so I can actually start doing a lot more cool stuff on YouTube. Like I said, doing tutorials, doing highlight videos, doing all this stuff that I want to do outside of Twitch to really grow myself as a... Uh, as a streamer, as an internet persona, so to speak. So, Razor Rambler! Ah! So, uh, yeah, I mean, that that's that's what I want to do. That I will keep talking about this as the week goes on. Um, me and uh, Tetra, actually, he asked me if I was streaming today. I was like, yeah, yeah, I'm going to stream. He's like, okay, I'll hold off till Tuesday. So, uh, me, and, me and the other streamers, we've been talking. We've been trying to get our, our uh, stream schedules going, right? And if I, if I can get enough support on that website, I'll be more than happy. Because it is, like, you know... It's razorgresher.com is the name of the website. I got that domain. Cha ching uh, But the homepage, homepage, man, is for everybody. It's not just for me. It is, it is like, my doing, my making, the deck list, people support me. Like I said, it's a community one. So if people are having, like, grandioso 12-hour streams like Tetra did, I will highlight you right on my homepage. Be like, hey, this is the day he's doing it. Make sure to check him out. I don't want to make a, home, like a, a website for me because that just, that just it makes me feel too needy. I want to make a website that everyone can go to, that everyone wants to just be a part of and wants to support. Because, hey, if, if it's not for you guys, that website wouldn't exist. And I'm, I'm high rolling on it, so any, any support, anything like that as well will be much appreciated. Um, uh, donations, subs, anything to keep the website up and running. All this stuff all comes from you guys, and I'm happy to do it so that uh, we can grow, grow this community going into... Uh, the going into the future of the classic format and everything like that. Uh, oh god, okay, so, uh, Kang Gang, hello everyone. What website? George Esther, uh, I am, my, I am putting up my own website for Light Seekers. It's gonna have, uh, all my classic deck lists. If anyone wants to share a deck list, uh, please email me at razorgreshu at gmail.com, your deck list. You know, your hero, your gamer tag, so I can give you credit for it, a description of how the deck works, what made you come to the deck, stuff like that. Boom, I'm gonna put it on my website. I'm gonna have that website up by the end of the month. I'm gonna shoot for Saturday. Maybe next week, Saturday, I don't know. Um, but that's the website that's going to come. It's going to have a lot of cool stuff. It's just kind of like a personal project that I'm doing um, for the community base, uh, so that we can have a site to just go for deck lists if you want to. I have a lot of it set up. I just got to make the pages for the deck lists. So I'm like, I feel like I'm 75 to 80% there. I just need your guys' support, your guys' uh, classic format deck lists. Anything you want to share with me, feel free. It's, it's open. It's community. That's what I want this website to be for. Uh, Region Raptor says, I'm going to send you some uh, some ideas I have for the community for possible Google Hangout games. If no, if not, no biggie or offense. Not sure the idea works best for the community since I'm new to TCGs. Dude, send me whatever you want. I will take a look at it. I'm more than happy to take a look at it. Uh, any online tournaments? I don't know. 
Um, if the if the community grows, like you know, starts supporting everything like that, I will post like, hey, right on the website, uh, right in like the homepage, be like, hey, we're having an online tournament this day. Make sure to connect to the Discord like this time, whatever. Here's the link to it, and have all this stuff so that like one one communal website, so everyone can kind of go to to convene and gather to do all that stuff. So yeah. I hope I hope it works out really well. I hope it gets everyone's hype for this game as much as I love this game. Um, but I mean, I've been theory crafting classic format decks the entire time. That was the number one thing that I consistently kept seeing on the Discord channel on the Facebook. It's like, where can I find deck lists? Anyone have the deck list for the classic format? What's the new meta? What's all this stuff, guys? We're making the meta. We will make the meta. All we have to do is share the deck list of what's been working. All this stuff. The more variety, the greater the meta. Like that's it's all up to us. Please help me help you. I, I am I am a taker, and I am a giver, not a taker. What you give to me, I will get put back tenfold. So thank you very much. Thank you. I will I will definitely uh, follow me on Twitter. I'm gonna post like updates on Twitter, how the website's going, stuff like that. So follow me there. It'll also give you like, hey, if I'm jumping on stream earlier, if I gotta work Saturday, my stream time changes up. Just follow me there. Otherwise, this, uh, the Twitter should be down below in my panels uh, for this Twitch channel as well. Uh, a lot of things, a lot of things are blowing up, guys. A lot of things are going huge. Uh, one more, I just saw we got a few more viewers. One more iteration. Please, please, please follow me on my YouTube channel. You will see a lot more awesome content on my YouTube channel coming in the future. Also, because if you follow my YouTube channel, you'll still be able to watch the streams after 24 hours after I film them. Because uh, at the end of this month, I am putting my Twitch stream on. If you want to watch the videos to subscribers only, so that uh, if you want to watch them right after the stream is done, you got to be a subscriber. Otherwise, they'll be up on YouTube within 24 hours. Same content. It's not like you're missing on anything. Just you watch it on a different platform. That's all it is. That's all it is, guys. All right. Awesome. 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 Now, many of you have probably tuned into Tetris stream. We're going to start out with the Thundervine that I sent him. Uh, I was doing a little tweaking. A little tweaking here and there after I played it. Um, but it's it pretty much, pretty much runs, um, you know, all... Um, air and lightning combos because uh, we don't run a whole lot of forests in here or at least we do but we want to use them for the lightning attack cards to discard them and you know pump up the damage so we don't want to be holding on to them or using them for um, like living thorns or for um, living whirlpool that kind of thing we want to be very aggressive with this deck as much as possible uh, the the forest cards that I added in here glade priest Glade Priest is just a good one. It heals, you draw his cards. If they don't use an ability, guess what? You discard it for additional two damage. Every card in here, every forest card in here, has that ability to be multi-useful in this deck, which is awesome. Which is why I was like, yeah, let's add in just some random forest cards, see what works. Uh, Orkley, oh, no, Overlook Defender is a great one in this deck. I found it to be a lot better than Moss Witch Defender, because instead of star uh, discarding uh, forest cards, you put them under this one to make the wall bigger. And if you're consistently trying to discard forest cards for your lightning attacks, put them under there, and your defense is a lot stronger. Oakthorn Warrior, I don't... Ooh, 10 free shards, sure. Uh, Oakthorn Warrior, I do have a lot of attack cards, but I mean, if you get attacked, hey man, 6 damage in one attack. Like That's that's pretty good, right? And it's a forest card, can be discarded. Um, Woods of Confusion. Now this card, this card, I will explain why I put this in here, why I put 3 of them in the deck. I have grown very fond of this card. Ever since I saw someone play it against me, I was like, wow, that's really cool. But the reason it works so well in this deck is because if you attack someone and then play Woods of Confusion, they can no longer attack you. Meaning that uh, all buff removal outside of Storm, they just can't do anything. Right? They can't do anything to your buff removal. And if they can't attack you, then you are free to just attack, 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 attack. You can attack them all day. They can defend... And they can buff, but they can't attack you. And if they, like, for some reason have an attack on theirs when you do this, your buff removal is buff-based. So you can just remove their buff, then put a buff on top of their discard pile, which means that you get to attack them again. Like, it's it's such a weird-looking card that you're like, oh, okay, you know, it's, it kind of has this meta. But I just feel like, along with Storms, uh, it has a lot more potential of just being really game swing And that's... That's what I really like about this, is that, like, like I said, because if they put an attack down there and you lay Woods of Confusion, then you Thunder Slug one of their buffs, a buff is now on top of theirs, so that you can attack them, and then they can't attack you because attack is on top of yours. That's awesome. That, that I think, is really cool. So, we're going to go into this. We're going to play some just casual games. Um, I did 
take out the evaporator and just put in crackling beast because I have found myself to be like, hey man, I do have a lot more buffs in play than drawing combos rather. So I mean like if um, if Tree Sprout's on its last corner, if Woods of Confusion's on its last corner, I don't care. Getting that six damage from him is just really, really beneficial. If Thunder Slug's on its last corner, toss it. There's just Crackling Beast is so much better than this. I originally built it as more of an elemental style deck. Uh, I had the uh, the Cyclone buffs to increase your elemental damage, but I was just I, I needed more just damage damage rather than trying to use uh, buff amplification for this deck. So with that being said, oh, I also saw one comment on Tetris Stream. The reason we are running um, like Chain Lightning over uh, Flying Debris. Flying Debris is a retired combo along with Cleansing Wind. I chose to put Cleansing Wind in here over Flying Debris because it's, yes, it's 9 more damage, uh, but it's also hand mitigation. So that's just another benefit. Storm Condo, oh, Storm Conduit's also in here because obviously you can't have both. But Storm Conduit, I mean, you, you pay for all this. You discard it to Overload when you don't have to, and Overload then becomes a uh, 14 damage card. Storm Conduit, you never want to lay Storm Conduit. Storm Conduit's always there to pay for things or be discarded to Overload. Like, that's that's the reason Storm Conduit's in here. Um, it, I did have Evaporator in here for Storm Conduit, too, because that would make Evaporator, I think, 8 damage as well, which was just awesome. But I think the Crackling Beast is going to have a lot more um, uh, ability with that. So, with that being said, guys, 20 Defend cards, you don't say. I think we're going to actually change that one. I don't want that one. See if I can get an 81. Yeah! Chimchu! Oh! Well, I gotta bust out my Chimchu family sometime today, along with Astral cards. And Lunar, my god, we're gonna play some Astral later. Um, so yeah, let's just go and let's play this Thundervine deck. Um, for, for a little spoiler, uh, could you write down this list and post that on your Twitter? I could. Yeah, I totally could. Um, I I'll do it after this game, if you want. You can't connect to the stream? No! F Fresh Jam, what's going on? Is it is it lagging? What's going on? Why is it uh, not connecting you to the stream? Obviously you're in the chat. You would like to build it before Saturday? What's on Saturday? What's, uh, what's going on Saturday? Boom, Living Cloud right off the top. The image is frozen? No! Alright, so him being Storm, I have seen this guy just be ridiculous. I'm going to put this out so he can no longer attack me. That's all I really want to do. All I really want to do. I have a buff removal in case he tries to buff or anything like that. Uh, the deck you have prepared is not good enough. D dude, that's fine. I mean, I, I don't know. Um, I mean, in my opinion, uh, if you're looking for like a competitive tournament style deck, I highly recommend... Oh my god! Oh, that's right, we're playing against Storm. We are playing against Storm. I highly recommend going and checking out Tetris stream, his 12-hour stream. He went through, like, three of the um, gold-tier qualifying decks, if you want to build one of those. I did do the first place one. I did Halvar. That's an amazing deck. Um, so, you know, more than happy to check that one out, too. Oh, guys. Guys, 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 guys. Do we... How how ham do we go right now? Do we Thunder Party into like Spark Wisp and Dust Fiend? I think we do. We're we're gonna have like really slow turns. This will be eight, seven, that's fifteen damage next turn. Then we're just gonna be like dead for two turns. I feel like we shouldn't have done that, but at the same time, I feel like it up. Enemy beneath, what is up? Uh uh everything. Everything is up. We have so much stuff going on right now. Welcome to the channel, man. Welcome. Make sure you follow me on YouTube, on uh, Twitter, uh, on uh, whatever you want to follow me on. On here, especially. Be a follower here. Oh! That is so rude. That is so rude, dude. Peter J. How dare you bubble fish me, man. Rude. But yeah, I, there's a lot of stuff going on. A lot of stuff is happening, man. Uh, it... If, if you weren't here in the beginning of the stream, if you're just tuning in now, uh, man, I think I want to pass, actually. This is kind of kind of a bummer. I think I want to pass. Um, okay, I got Crackling Beast. I mean, I can start hitting soon. Um, I'm just going to copy and paste this so I don't have to keep typing it every time. 
Uh, that is my new email. Oh, man! Not Storm Shaman. I have a feeling I'm gonna be getting hit real hard real soon. This deck does not do healing all that well. Um, man. This Thunder Party just, just got destroyed by that Bubble Fish. Yeah, this is a really bad play. This is a really bad game for me. Uh, I have not, you have not caught me online yet. Oh, welcome, welcome, first timer, how's it going? Um, but yeah, other things that are happening in the future, that email address that I just linked. If you have any fun classic format desks you would like to share with the community, please send them to my email, send your gamer tag, send a, uh, a brief description of the deck. I am currently in the process of building my own community website to post all the deck lists for classic format that I can gather, that I can make. Wow, he's, okay. How much? Just eight, sure, sure. Um, yeah, but that's that's pretty much what I'm doing. I am building myself a community website. Uh, it's it's almost up and running. I want to say by the end of this week, maybe next week too. Uh, latest. Uh, oh man, I gotta I gotta. I mean, it doesn't matter. This is just it does nothing. It just sits here and counters us the whole time. So why? God, that is the most disappointing and upsetting thunder party I've ever seen in my life. I could chain lightning him next turn because the combo will be on top. But uh, yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna do a communal uh, deck list. I'm gonna try and get all the ones from the gold tournaments, from the silver tournaments, anything classic format. Really, I'm gonna just consistently. Um... You haven't talked to me since the Halo Two land parties, dude. I... I that oh my god, I need I need to know who you are. I need to know who you are right now because. That, that did not happen. Like, those Halo 2 land parties happened 10 plus years ago for me. Oh my god, this is a blast from the past. I need, I... <laughs> uh, actually, True Spot, we're gonna want. We're gonna want that for card draw and healing. Dude! I, like... Cody? Oh my god, dude, Cody, what is up? I haven't seen you. Dude! I don't even know when the last time I saw you. How did you... Okay, first of all, it's awesome that you found me. Awesome that you're watching me. Thank you very much for tuning in, man. It's, it's great to have you here. Dude, those... Oh, sweet. I can bubble fish thunder... Uh, thunder... Or living cloud. Spark wisp. Sure. Sure. Uh, actually, maybe I just want a thunder slug tree sprout here. Next turn I can living cloud. I don't... Yeah, get rid of that. I don't care. Get out of here. Get out of dodge. Uh, well, no, actually, I have a lot of damage. I'll have six, next I'll have eleven, so yeah, maybe I just do want to push right now. Um, ooh. Yeah, in case he tries to heal. It is a little bit of a gamble, but I'll take it. I will take it. That's what the forest guards are there for, man. Uh, yeah, dude, a lot of stuff's happening here. A lot of stuff's happening. How have you been, man? Cody, how have you been? I haven't talked to you in ages. Final chance. I did. I have been promoting it on Facebook, so that very well could be. And I still have 11 damage. Yes! Could just pass. Oh, guys. Crackling Beast. Crackling Beast for the win. Yes! Get that damage in there. Thundervine coming in. For the clutch victory. Everyone's here sitting there thinking, man, Thundervine. I'm not that strong. What, why would I play Thundervine? There's so many other heroes. There are, but he's still fun. You started your own channel when you saw I had one, you thought it for sure need to check it out. Dude, welcome! Welcome to my channel. I have to check yours out. What do you what uh, what games do you play on your channel, man? Might I recommend Lightseekers? Very fun TCG that's blowing up. Um, okay, so let's... I will post it on Twitter. If I can find my Twitter. Just for you. Just for you. Destiny 2, alright. Yeah, now that it's now that it's free. I keep kind of chuckling now because everyone's like, Yeah, I bought it for like 60 bucks. And uh, then all of a sudden, at like Christmas time, like, yeah, we're gonna have our Destiny Two for free. And I was like, what? Yes, please. Oh man. Actually, I can do this from the website. 
You've paid for it twice now? Oh, dude. I... I am so sorry. Oh my god, guys. I have 26 followers on Twitter. I did not even know that. It does not notify me. It does not notify me when I have a new follower on Twitter, so that's pretty awesome. Uh, First Chance says, when is the 12-hour stream? The 12-hour stream will be notified when I'm ready to build my website, when I'm ready to get it up. Uh, obviously, the more deck lists the website has, the longer it'll take me, but the better it will be when it comes out. So, as I said, I really want to shoot for like a Saturday so I can do the 12-hour stream, because that's the only time I really can do it. So, if not this Saturday, definitely next week's Saturday. Because uh, if it's not up by this Saturday, I'm going to be spending the whole time making sure that website gets up. And then I will launch the website live right at the beginning of the stream, promote it on the stream channel, have everyone go go out and see it, and everyone will be like, Oh my god, this stream is so awesome! It's got a website! It's so cool and sleek and light seekery and all that fun jazz. So, uh, follow me on Twitter. I'll post when I have it there. If not, I will post it on Facebook. I will post it on the Discord. I will post everywhere I can to show you, hey man, 12-hour stream for the promotion of my website. Uh, I bought it and released with PC, thinking most people would play on that. They didn't. Oh, man. Oh, man. That's that's a bummer. I, I would have thought PC would have been really good for it, too. Alright, sorry, guys. One sec. I was requested to put this on my Twitter... So that is what I'm going to do. This will be the first, first Twitter deck list. So hang with me. Please, please don't leave while I type and not read your comments. I really should have just said, I'll do this after the stream, or when I take a break, but we've committed already. So I am I apologize. I'm just going to keep rambling, because I can't read the comments because the screen's not up. And I'm just, I'm just going to hope I fill in the empty space and you guys can just listen to my sweet, sultry voice and be like, yeah, this is exactly what we tuned in for. We tuned in for him ignoring us, but talking to himself like he's some sort of ignorant... Light secret punk. I'm gonna come back and everyone's either gonna be laughing at me or be like, dude, this guy needs to be quiet. We just listen to the background music for this game. That's all I really want. That's not how you spell therapeutic. Oh, oh, okay, so it's got to be broken into several. Here it is. Boom. Right to my Twitter. Right to my Twitter. It is on. We did it like Donkey Kong. All right. I think this worked fine. I feel like... I mean, we got royally messed up with that Thunder Party and then Bubblefish right there. I tossed my Thunder Slug away thinking I should be fine, but that came to bite me in the butt. Uh, the stream gang boys found more people on Xbox. Oh, awesome, man. Awesome. Uh, stream, or er, Steam, yay. Oh, dude, I can't wait for Steam. I'm Brian House, Baha, the high-pitched voice, man. Oh, dude, I love my high-pitched voice. It's gonna be so spicy. I'm gonna splice that joke. Dude, you splice that, put it in your next rap song, okay? Like, emote me. Put, put like, a, a Photoshop wig on my head, just so we can be, like, I'll be pink, you'll be blue. It'll be hot. So hot. Restaurant. Steam is going to be lit. Yes. It was too funny. We love that voice. No worry. No worries. So what? We won't leave you. Lightseekers punk. We. Oakthorn can only have one. Rip. 
Oakthorn. No, I didn't think Oakthorn got rotated out, did it? It did! D Malone for the save. This is not classic format, guys. This is not classic format. Oh! D Malone, thank you for that. I could have swore. I could have sworn. Alright. Alright. Um. Man, crushing my dreams. Crushing my dreams, man. But thank you for that. Thank you for catching that. That would have been royally. Royally messing me up. Um. We don't really have a whole lot of buffs. Disturbed Elemental. Could be six attack when we remove one of their buffs. Boom. Uh, uh, Cody, actually, I have a emulator on my PC that I'm doing this right now. Um, it, it's BlueStacks. Basically turns my screen into a, an Android. Uh, it's coming out for Steam, hopefully, by the end of next month. We're all crossing our fingers for it. But, dude, this is, this is a fun game. I've been playing it since, like, June of 2017. Alright, alright, alright. Let's see if I can edit this real quick. How do I... Oh my god, how do I edit a tweet? Guys, how do I edit a tweet? I can't, can I? Once it's there, it's there. There is no going back. D Malone, you just built the Thundervine? Oh man, D Malone. Hey. If you, if you did not know, I am making my own website for a community-wide decklist gathering. Um, Copy-paste, man, you know it. Uh, please t uh, send send any and all deck lists that are classic format to that website or to that email address. Put your gamer tag and a brief description of what the deck is, and I will make sure to add it to my deck list website that I have going up. It should be up within a week, two max. And as soon as I do, I'm having a 12 hour stream to celebrate for it. Uh, I'm going to try and just get everyone, everyone to get uh, classic format deck lists on there so that people can stop being like, hey, well, I, wh wh where's the meta? What are the deck lists? I need, like, is there a good deck out there that's really good? Dude, here, here's a bunch of them for you, man. Go go nuts. Go nuts. Community-wide deck list gathering at this website. So please, please, if you if you don't want to participate, I'm not making you. I'm not making you at all. This is this is simply your choice. If you want to hold back and be like, I think I have a really good deck I don't want anyone to know about until after a tournament. Dude, hold back. I'm not saying you have to give it to me. I'm just saying this. We're all a community here. It's all good to build a community. If you find a fun deck, send me a fun deck, man. Tell me, like, hey, I haven't won a single game with it, but I like the concept. Oh, put it right on that deck list, man. Uh, I have, like, 80% of it done. All i got to do is add the pages for the deck lists. And then I have it all all set and ready to go. Uh, if, the, if the page picks up steam, the homepage is going to start celebrating. Uh, since I, I know for a fact the Umbrun house is on here right now. Dude, uh, if you start putting out highlight videos, I'll, pu I'll put a video right in the homepage. Be like, check out the new Umbrun house, stuff like that. I'm, I'm more than happy to promote everyone and anyone on my website. Uh, it is a website. It is RazorGrassroot.com. When it comes out, I'll put it up there. Um, can we rate or review deck lists? Uh, I will find a way for you guys to leave comments if I can find a way to do that. Um, but otherwise, it's, right now it's just a deck list type of thing. As we get into it later, uh, I'll see if I can put in like an add comment section or something like that. And we can see if we can get that going. But right now, like I said, it's just a very basic uh, website to put deck lists on. Um, promote other streamers if they're having stuff like Tetra had a 12-hour stream. He's promoting that. I'll put it right on the home page so when everyone comes to my page, they're like, Oh, Tetra's doing a home stream on this day at this time. Make sure to tune in for that. I am, I am more than happy to promote anyone and everyone, make our community grow. I am not trying to self-promote. I am trying to just make it easier for us all to get together outside of the Discord. Because um, Discord is good for uh, discussions, but if you want to find like you know highlight videos or something like that, right there on the homepage, I've been finding that a lot easier to do. Uh, so yeah, that's, that's my contribution. That's what I've been working on, as everyone else has been doing their own thing. Uh, but yeah, so a Disturbed Elemental. Everyone okay with that? Everyone okay with Disturbed Elemental? I kind of think, maybe like, I feel like Oakthorn Warrior is still good, but Disturbed Elemental, I mean, that one's just, if you remove a buff, and our Thunderslug is going to remove quite a bit. Uh, Rating of the Decks would be nice. Yeah, I hope so. I, I hope I can find a way to do that. Uh, Umbarn House says, Oh, thanks, man. I appreciate that. How awesome. And I've been uh, meaning to speak with you about 
routing people to your streams and YouTube channel as well for the same intentions growing the community. Dude, definitely. I will more than reach out. You reach out to me, vice versa, or whatever. Um, we will we will get together and start making sure that the traffic comes to both our channels, to all the channels of the Light Secret community. We really want to get the traffic going out there. I know a lot of people do come to Discord and talk, but then they're always like, "How do I like? Where do I go to find stuff? It's not on the Light Seekers homepage." Dude, we got we got YouTube, we got Twitch, we got everything and anything out there. We'll just we'll get them. We'll get all the websites going, and having a one communal website to then promote other websites, I think, would be really good. And that's that's what I'd like to do. That's what I'd like to do. So. Keep an eye out for that, like I said, within a week or two, that'll all be up. 12-hour stream promoting it. Uh, it is it is costing me a pretty penny to keep the website going, so any and all donations, sub subscribers, all benefit towards that. It's all co going right back into you guys, so awesome. Uh, so, now that we got that fixed, D Malone, I'm going to come back to you. Is this, is this classic format legal now? I thought it was, and then all of a sudden, like, Oakthorn Warrior just, just came and ruined it. Came and ruined my day. Uh, I should probably add a comment here. Just. Perfect. Add it to the tweet. It's in the comment section. I don't feel like a dumbie. Uh, I'll use two. Uh, where can we donate? Uh, if Down below in my panels, uh, there should be a donation button. Right down below. Um, click on that. Minimum of like a dollar, I think, and whatnot. Send me a comment, whatever you want to do. Um, but yeah, I, f I fixed my panels last week. Got them all updated. So it, lo it looks pretty now. It has my Twitter feed on there. Uh, it has the donations. has my YouTube uh, link has uh, a timer countdown for when my streams are. I'm trying to get a consistent streaming schedule so you guys can always know when to find me instead of going like, oh, is you going live today? What's going on with this work schedule? So I try to get everything looking fancy and whatnot. I've been I've been putting in hours, man. At, at work, I work 60 hours a week, and then I come home and I start doing this. My girlfriend's like, hey, I'm here too. And I'm like, no, no, no I know you are. Trust me. It's so like this past weekend, I hung out with her. We watched a bunch of fun movies. So kind of took a break because I've been, I've been busting my butt drinking energy drinks, getting three hours a night's sleep, trying to get everything going for you guys because, hey, I'm a giver, not a taker. I want to grow this community with you guys, and I want you guys to hold my hand with me as we go on this amazing adventure we have. All right. That being said, let's let's hit that play button. Let's hit that play button. We have an Overseer Tusk Rage. All right, guys. Let's go. Can't find the countdown? What you mean you can't find the countdown? Uh, bro, the struggle is here. Ah, my wife won't let me hear the end of it if I miss a date day. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, man. I, I try and specifically say, like, hey, you know what? Uh, Saturdays, if, I, if I'm doing something and you have to work in the morning, that's when I'll stream. Like, that's, that's my streaming time. And then when you get home from work, that's when we do stuff until Sunday or something like that. Sunday, um... She has two cats in a queen size bed, and I have a king size bed, and no cats in my apartment. I also have to get up at the butt crack at like three in the morning to work. So usually on Sundays I go home and sleep, and so she can wake up and feed her cats and go to work too. Uh, oh, going against going against dread. I mean, I'd really like to get a buff in here, but I think living cloud. This is the best time to do living cloud. Uh, no. Maybe discarding Oakthorn Warrior would have been better. I don't know. To feed into it. We'll see. We'll see. Getting another Living Cloud. I just gotta hope, you know, he has no buffs. Uh, Fresh Jan, I'm... Oh, uh, there goes a buff. Of course it is. The stream countdown. Um, did you find it? Did you, uh, hopefully upload my stream and it was there? So... Yeah, I really don't want to do anything. Like, I want, I almost want to buff in here before I lay Woods of Confusion. Hey, James Rieff. Thank you very much for the follow, man. Thank you for the support. Anything and everything is always welcome, so I very much appreciate it, man. I very much do. I hope you're enjoying yourself. I hope I'm not rambling too, too much, too less. Cannot tell. I tend to talk a lot, and then you guys just say whatever you want, and I read your comments mid-sentence. That's how this goes. Uh, so, uh, I could Therapeutic Eel, but I don't have any defense or healing in this deck, so we're going to basically be taking seven in this turn. 
I feel like that's fine. We have a lot of attack in hand, so we just have a lot of damage. It'll be fine, I think. Hello, I'm new to Light Seekers. Glad to see you streaming. Dude, welcome! Welcome to the community. Uh, we, we are a bunch of fun-loving goofballs, so feel free to stick around, enjoy yourself, have some fun with us. Uh, we really just, we're here to build up hype, build up the community, build up the viewer base, and the potential for this game, because, I mean, it's, it's going through the roof. This game is amazing, it's, it's so insane, so thank you very much for the support. Welcome to Light Seekers, it's George Esther. I keep telling you, I keep calling you George Esther, because that's how I read it, but your name is actually George Stir, so it's just George Stir. I don't know, I, I feel like it's funny, to, it's better to say George Esther. I just, I feel like it is. Uh, how many cards does he have in hand? Nine? Ooh, I can actually heal and draw from this, this is awesome. You're good, man, bro. Welcome, bro. Uh, okay, okay, okay. So, see, now Lightning Conduit is really fun. I found this to be really cool. Okay, so I... Do I just Spark Wisp here for day? No, I feel like Living Conduit into Spark Wisp will be a better turn. Yeah, because this is a defense card. George Esther. Like Ether? Esther? Interesting. George Esther. George Esther. Oh, man. Alright, guys. Um, Alright, what are the chances he has Shadow Puppet? I'm going to say slim to none. Although, if he does attack me, I do have Oakthorn Warrior for next turn. So, whoop, whoop. Uh, it also put a buff on top, so my Woods of Confusion, slam that down, he can no longer lay buffs against me. I think we're in a really good spot. Guys, I called Shadow Puppet. I called it! Mind you now, if I put Woods of Confusion down, I can no longer attack him, so I'd really like something to be on top that's not an attack card. There's a buff. There's a buff. So I think what I want to do here is I just want to kind of Oakthorn Warrior. Um, I mean, do I Spark Wisp? I feel like I do Spark Wisp here for 11. I'll take three. He'll want to try and do something else. Um... I want to keep that. I want to keep that as utility. Dude, bring up all the nostalgia. All the nostalgia. The one Oakthorn Warrior. Yeah, the one. The one and only. Dude, yeah, bring up bring up some nostalgia. I want to hear this. I want to go... I want to time travel, like, for 20 years with you, man. A Mantic Spitter. All right. All right. So he's got two damage reduction up. I... Ooh, what do I do here? Maybe I Woods of Confusion next turn, and I pass right now. Those are some really, really nice cards to be pulling. Another Shambler, really? Okay, dude. And a Putrid Infestation, oh my word. Okay, well, I think... Yeah, I think laying this is gonna be fine. I really don't even want a Sparkling or a Spark Beast, because it would only do three damage. So I'm just gonna pass. Shambler City, tell me about it, man. They're everywhere. Uh, I was thinking about this the other day. I think I have my copy somewhere, but still. But the BHS has some of the funniest stuff I've ever seen. The, wait, are we, are we talking about Jim Bakken eating 60 pieces of gum? Are we talking about that BHS? Dude, <laughs> dude, really? Oh man, oh man, I haven't, oh, okay guys, here's, here's what we're gonna do, we're gonna put this, this is gonna tick uh, the fort away and then buff's gonna be on there so he can no longer buff me. Oh, clutch plays. And then I 
think we're gonna pass. We are gonna take two next turn. He can no longer uh, buff, though. He can attack me, but he can't. Oh my god, I have not even remembered that. That was like middle school, man. That was like middle school. I'm 30. Fresh Gen, thanks for stopping by, man. Thanks for stopping by. Like I said, follow me on Twitter. Go to check out my YouTube channel. All this stuff. Uh, to keep, keep informed of when everything's happening for me. Okay, so I'm gonna take one and one. I think. Oh, I mean, he's gonna have damage reduction on his next few turns. So I think right now doing this is fine. He still can't buff against me. I'm gonna be healing. I don't really want to attack him because that means that he can lay his buffs down again. Uh, maybe I just hold off until. Yeah, I'm gonna go down to seven, seven, six, five. Man, if he mantixes me, this is just. Actually, maybe I do attack, so he can't mantix me. Maybe I do attack, so he can't. So he can lay buffs all the day he wants. Um. Do I increase it by two, maybe? Actually, yeah. Yeah, why not? I don't need another one of those. Tim sold me a copy our junior year. Really? Maybe maybe it was my maybe it was in in high school then. Maybe it was in high school. Dude, that is oh, that is so long ago. So long ago. Good times, though. Okay, there's a buff. I really just didn't want him to mantix me down. Draga Hunter's fine. Guys, Overload coming in for the win. Overload coming in clutch. Because it's a lightning attack card as well, I can discard this, and I think... Is it just action cards, or is it attack? Am I allowed to increase it by two with a forest? I am! Oh! Get wrecked! BFC days. <laughs> I worked there for 13 years. I have nostalgia purposes for the BFC days. I really do. I like. I want to stop in someday just to say hi to everyone to see who's still there. I wouldn't necessarily say I miss it. You, dude, everyone wishes they would have taken it a little more seriously. It was. It's the first time job for high school kids. We're all gonna be a little goofy. A little, a little rude and mean. So yeah, guys, this Thunderfine deck, I mean, it's it's pulling out wins by the, the skin of our teeth. But it's pulling out those wins. Pulling out those wins. Now, I do... I'm going to stream till 10 today. Because I'm feeling good, I'm feeling amped. Uh, Rafi! Alright. Uh, so this is going to be a four-hour stream, a little longer than usual, so stay tuned for a lot of fun stuff. We're going to take a break here at around 8 o'clock. We're going to cut my segment into two-hour segments for the YouTube channel purposes. Actually, I'll probably do two one-hour. So after this game, I'll do like a 30-second clip for YouTube purposes. Get that on there. This Electro Hopper, I swear to God, I am not letting you keep that, dude. I have been wrecked by that so many times. Get out of here. Get out of my house. No, anyone who watches the stream knows how much I hate that card. And then I'll heal for two and draw. So I have all for us. Wow, I literally drew all my force. This Glade Priest against him, though, is going to be clutch. Clutch. Rocket Star, hey man, how's it going? I don't know what you guys are talking about because I was born in the early 2000s. Hey man. Some people had to be. Dude, it blew my mind thinking that not, a, not just a few years ago, there were people that are going into high school that literally were not alive during the time of 9-11. Uh, that blew my mind. I was like, wait, what? Like, I think it was, what was it, 2016? The freshman class of 2016 were not born during 9-11. And that just, like, it sunk in, and I was like, oh my god. You were born a day after it? Alright, to make that story even better, be like, no, no, I was born a day after it. They put me in a, they put me in a parachute and threw me out the window, and I survived. Like, raised by the wild New Yorkers. I feel old, I'm 30. Dude! 30! 
Cowboy hat Valor, 30. 30 bros, man. Dude, is... Okay. Is this just the... the, the we all graduated in 2017 stream? Is that what's going on? Class of 2017? 29 almost... You'll get there. You'll get there, Cody. I, I trust you. He thunderslugged it. Man. Now he's going to use his ability and... Ah, oh, what a bummer. You're 37. I feel old for them. Hey, man. Someone's got to be the responsible adult here. Someone's got to be the responsible adult. Um... Okay, here's what I'm thinking. I'm thinking we literally just pass. Because uh, what'll happen is this will go on the top of my discard pile, then I can spark wisp him and Woods of Confusion to make it so that he just can't attack me. I think that's a pretty good play. Hello, my username has my birth year in it. Filthy fun. As it does, 88. James, if you're not the responsible party, I don't know who is. Because I am clearly not responsible for that. Okay? You're putting way too much pressure on me. I already got to promote a stream. I got to gotta host this channel for you guys. Entertain you on this, this Monday evening. You can't put that pressure on me, man. You can't do it. Uh, so... Oh! Oh! He wants to attack me next turn, but guess what? Uh, actually, no, I'm going to keep all that. Guess what? Sorry, man. You you can't attack me. You can't you can't even use that attack ability while that's on top. Mm. Guys, how much did I just ruin his day? Show of hands. Show of hands. Hmm. He can't attack me, but he can do that. All right. Well, I can't defend, but I can still attack him now. He can he can buff and defend. Oh, man. I was going to take a lot there. I, I can almost guarantee, guarantee, gosh darn to you it. Uh, okay, so... This is going to, what, move two cards from my hand back? These combos I'm never going to be able to pay for, but if I draw two... Wait, wait, hold on. Oh, okay, it's a defense. I was like, why can't I lay that? He got me, guys. He got you. I can't barkeep him. I cannot barkeep him. Well, now I can't lay buffs. That's what we're on to right now. He wants to use that attack ability. He's like, why won't this work? But you, you can't. I have an attack on top. Oh, it's, you can't lay cards? Is that what it is? You can't lay cards, but you can be a... 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 a Doshenki? Is that really what it is? You can't play cards? Let me look at this card. Let me, let me read my own card! I can see it. It says play. You cannot play a card. Abilities are still fine. I learned that too. Guys, this is all a learning process to me. Thunder. Really, dude? Well, that's two thunder slugs down, I suppose. Okay, well, I mean, we, neither of us can buff. I'm gonna do this and see what I draw. So that's just rude. Um, I mean, yeah, there's, no, there's not really anything for me to do right now. He's got a much larger hand. Storm Condo doesn't even help because I don't have lightning attack action cards. Attack action. Attack, attack, attack action. Man, two Thunder Slugs. Two already. He has been drawn quite a bit, though. No, he's not. We've both drawn the same amount. He's just been getting extremely lucky. Cleansing Wind, are you for real right now? Well, Ralphie, what do we have? What element? Lightning. There's one. There's one. I wonder if we're playing a very similar deck. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna do this. And call it good. Oak Thorn Warrior, in case he attacks me, I get to attack him back. Bring it up. Bring it up. Well, there's an attack. Question is... Is he going to attack me again? He is. He is going to attack me. Yep. That solves that problem. 
Well, man, I am just... I am... Yeah, it doesn't even go under there, does it? So I couldn't... Uh, what's it confused? Well, I can't double forest anyway. I honestly think I'm just dead. Him getting all those Slender Slugs and just wrecking my day. He got really good draws. And, uh... Him pulling out a Hurricane Spirit and a Storm Shaman, like... Wow. This deck looks very eerie to mine, like almost 100%. Uh, I don't run Storm Shaman or Hurricane Spirit in this deck, though. I wonder why I don't, in all honesty. They're good cards. So... If I attack him... And then there was a confusion, he can't attack me. Which I'm fine with. Finally buff removal. After all this time. Yeah, I feel... I feel like Forest is such a hard alignment to use for healing now that it has almost no healing anymore. With Spore Feeder going. I mean, it still has that Sumptuous Shaman and all this stuff, but that's a buff healing. Everyone else's healing is a defend action. So, like, it's really difficult to find healing in this deck outside of, um, like, unaligned cards. Um, I mean, he's already used quite a bit of buffs. I think just doing this is fine. And then I'll pass. So right now, right now, he can either buff or defend. And if he lays a buff, it's just dead. And I got, like, I got real crappy cards in hand. I might just pass next turn while he can't attack me. Try and build up a, a decent hand. Yeah. Like, I feel like that's what this deck suffers from. Is that, yeah, you can Woods of Confusion and stall out in some cases... But without the healing, what are you really stalling towards? Like, what are, what are you trying to stall for? Is... So, I am... What would you guys think? Maybe... Do we, do we try and toss lightning back or do we toss air? I know air is really potent. He's mastery in air. I'm thinking air is the one we cleansing wind. I think air is the one that we cleansing wind. Air just seems right. Wow. And I'm dead. How long was he sitting on that? Did he just draw that? Man. The clutch. The clutch. Well done. Well done. So. Two and three with this. I mean, we, we really do need healing. Now I think about it, is Lightning Storm ro being rotated? Is that being rotated? No, it's not. Should we try and run Lightning Storm over Chain Lightning? Should we switch that one out? Just so when we make it so like they can't attack, we can still buff with Chain Lightning? Or do we take out Thunder Party for Chain Lightning? Maybe we take out Thunder Party for Chain Lightning? Or, uh, uh Lightning Storm? Maybe that's the one. We have never really successfully been able to lay Thunder Party. So maybe, yeah, we just put in Lightning Storm. It's not being rotated. It's not being rotated. I think that's I think that's the, the appropriate play. More damage from Lightning Storm. Uh, Thunder Party was just... It was not serving us a purpose at all. Every time we laid it, it got nerfed into the ground with a hammer. And I just cried. That's all that happened is I just cried. So, I mean, like, what defend cards do we have here for healing, right? Do we have, um, because I, I feel like we do need to find a way to heal. I hit buff. Wow. We don't really have that many buffs, so Spore Feeder can't help us a whole lot. Um, the only beast buff I think we have is Thunderslug, and that has burn. 
The Umbron House, dude, thank you very much for the tier one sub. I appreciate it. I, I truly appreciate the support. I know you donated like 150 bucks to Tetris Stream, so I'm surprised you still have enough money for a sub. But, dude, thank you. Thank you very much. I truly appreciate that. Oh, that makes me that makes me feel so warm and happy inside. I'm all all fuzzy with the goose bubbles. Um, like in Price Cloud is only two healing. Frenzy Zap. If Frenzy Zapper could get increased, I think it would be really fun. But it's just like I almost feel like I need to find a weapon for him. I need to find a, a weapon to splash in some defense. But he, he wants to run Lightning and Forest. Like, he doesn't want to really run anything else. So it's just, oh, it's really difficult to be able to sur try and survive. What is, what do we have here for defend cards to heal? There's, there's Kreebel Nurse. If I took eight or more, I'm never going to take eight or more. Not in a million years. Um... Do we just add in Umbron Thieves? Do we add in Umbron Thieves? It is three healing if I'm below, and usually nine times out of ten I'm going to be below. If we add in Umbron Thief, what do we put in? Or what do we take out? Maybe the, the Lightning Conduit, uh, for this deck, actually I don't think it's going to work all that well. Um, Lightning Conduit feels like more of a mid-range deck where you want to get more value out of the cards, and I feel like we're, gonna, we're just trying to burst them. Right? We're just trying to attack them as much as possible, which means that Cloud Harvester also doesn't feel all that great. Um, I mean, it is, it is a buff. I feel like the utility of Blade Priest is nice, but we might not need it. We might just need more damage. I mean, our, our only card draw we have is Umbron Barkeep, Tree Sprout, and Therapeutic Heal. I, I feel like almost that's where that's where we need uh, to fix is our, our draw power. Which means, do we try and add in a Hermit or a Spirit? Do we try and add in one of those? Because I can take Cloud Harvester out. I'm trying to think the only buffs I have in here. Yeah, I don't even have that many buffs, so maybe actually just adding in um a hurricane hermit is fine. It'll let me draw cards. If they kill it, they kill it. That's what they waste their buff removal on. Obviously the Oakthorn Defender would really really hurt if I had to remove that. Actually, let's go Spirit. I feel like we have enough card draw. One Spirit will be fine. One Spirit's fine. If we can make it so they can't attack and remove Hurricane Spirit, they'll build up their hand. Then I'll move the cards from their hand back. That feels... That feels a lot better. Yeah, Vortex Planes was the one I was trying to make work. Because uh, a lot of these cards are actually Elementals. Uh, Disturbed Elemental, Dust Fiend, Dust King, Hurricane Spirit, Living Cloud, Spark Wisp. Like, all of this, almost all my attack cards are Elementals. So I was trying to find a way to add in um, Vortex Planes to just get a little more consecutive damage. But at the same time, if I wasn't drawing cards, it was a dead card. It just didn't feel good. It just didn't feel good. Alright, I think, I think that's a fine change. 
I think that's a fine change. Yeah. Yeah, because Woods of Confusion also draws me a card, too. So, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right. All right. This feels good. This feels good. We'll jump back in. I would laugh so hard if we just, like, lose games right away. Oh, hold on. Hold on, guys. For purposes of YouTube, bear with me one sec. <laughs> 